Hey guys, Arlen here. I just wanted to show you what I've set up with Google for JCCY. Um, basically some cool features um, and let me show it to you right now. The web address for this is www.google.com slash a slash jccy.org okay and we each have our own username and password I'll give those all to you um, as soon as you sign into your account I would recommend you change the password and Google might ask you to automatically change it okay so let me sign in it's gonna take me here um, these are all the tools that Google has for us um, sites like an internal website documents this would be a great place to share securely um, just various documents the threat and global war document we can put that here directors checklist um, the training manual for PGM directors anything we want to put up here it's secure only people with a username and password can access them and we can share them among all of the uh, directors using this website okay the calendar is what I think we'll use a lot of email I'll show you how that works and there's a little chat thing that only works in Windows right now so um, I'm kind of out of the loop because I've become a Mac guy so anyway let me show you the email if you're familiar with Google this is just Gmail you can compose messages check your inbox all this other good stuff um, and really you never have to use this if you don't want to because I've set it up so everybody has your name at jccy.org and when somebody emails you it's sent directly to your home email or your work email whatever email I had for you okay so you never have to do anything with this jccy.org email you never have to check it nothing things that are sent to you here will go automatically to your home inbox wherever you receive mail okay the only thing I will warn you is because of this forwarding if you if you get a request like hey I'm interested in the China mission that gets forwarded to your home email box you open it up at home if you respond to the email they will whoever's getting the message whoever you're emailing back they will get your home email address okay if you want to keep that private you're gonna to have to set it up a little bit uh, a little bit differently I can help you with that if you want or you can come to the website and respond to certain requests right here okay that's just a warning okay if you ever respond from your home email people will get your home email address okay just so that's clear okay but if you don't mind that uh, you never have to check this JCCY box ever Okay, I'm going to jump over now to the calendars. I think this is what we're going to use a lot. Okay, and basically everybody has everybody has a couple of calendars. Everybody has um, like a personal calendar. Arlen at jccy.org. I'm never going to ever use that because I have my own personal calendar. I want to use the PGM Japan calendar. Okay, so you can see I've highlighted that one. Okay, I also have a couple of events here. I have this uh, PGM Japan meeting at CCAK office, and I mistakenly put it at 6 a.m. Uh, it's going to be a little bit later than that. It's going to be at 4, so I'll just drag it down here. Okay, events updated automatically. Um, I've got a little due date up here okay due $200 deposit okay that looks good I like the date 
I call that, I'll save that. If I want to add something else, like, um, okay, do applications and pastoral rec. Calendar is set to PGM Japan. That's good. I'm going to create that event. And that comes out there. The beauty of this is when you come down here, that little triangle, you click on that. You click on calendar settings. And you scroll down a little bit. You have this calendar address. Okay. I'm going to click on HTML, which is your typical web format. You get the address of this calendar. Okay, so then you can oops, click and highlight this. I'm going to copy it with Control C. Click OK. And now I can email this calendar. Jump over to the email. Start a new message. Compose mail. Okay. PGM Japan Team 2010. This is just an example. I don't really have an email list like that. Subject, PGM Japan Calendar. Okay. I'm going to control V, paste that in there, and this is the calendar for this year. Hi guys. Here's the calendar of meetings, due dates, etc. Check it out. Okay, I'm not really going to send this message. It's just an example for you guys to see. But that's one way you can use um, both your calendar and your email together. Now, when I send this, my PGM Japan team will get an email from arlen at jccwa.org with a link to the calendar and all this info. Okay. Um, the beauty of this calendar and stuff is it integrates real well with Blackberries, with iPhones, um, with Outlook. If people are using Outlook on their computers, it just integrates real well with um, people's uh, life, with how they're managing their activities. Okay, and I think we're going to use the calendars a lot. Uh, thank you, Jeff, for suggesting this. I think it's a great idea. Let me quickly show you documents and sites. Okay, Google Docs. I'm going to close this here. Google Docs, this is just a, a great place to, uh, we can upload some of our files that we have. Um, like I mentioned, the uh, PGM Director's Checklist, the uh, PGM Director's Training Manual, all those things can be uploaded here. Um, and shared internally. So only directors, only people with a login and a password can access them. Okay, this is secure stuff. Good stuff. Okay, sites, this is kind of like an internal site. Um, browse the site. I, I've created a staff homepage. It's nothing special, but if we wanted to use it, it's here. I don't think we'll ever use it. Um, I think we'll stick with the mail, the calendar, and the documents, and those three will keep us pretty busy. Okay, well, hope this has helped you guys. If you have any questions, just call me or email me. I'll, I'll help you. If you want to set the calendar up on your BlackBerry, whatever, um, I can help you with that. Um, I'd rather do that in person, so bring your iPhone, bring your BlackBerry down to me I'll help you out with that okay I uh, hope this helps you and uh, yeah hope you enjoy it I really enjoy this stuff okay see you guys later bye